Good morning. Let us begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In our Gospel reading according to St. John, we hear the words yet again, Do not let your hearts be troubled. And Jesus adds, Do not let them be afraid. You can almost feel the affection and deep care Jesus has for his friends as he approaches the great crisis of his arrest, passion, and crucifixion. He is anxious and stressed, but he does his best to encourage his friends to be strong in times of trouble. Can you hear his soothing and caring words addressed to you? Learn to let go and then to cry out for help and share your troubles and fears with him. Jesus wants us to lean on him in our times of trouble and to rest assured that he is there to help us with whatever crosses we have to bear. Jesus promises us peace, a peace that the world cannot give. I don't know of anyone who does not desire and yearn for inner peace. Do we not all yearn for peace in our families and in our communities? The world is in the state of shock. The world is shocked by wars that seem never ending, where no one seems willing to seek peace. On this day, let us pray and ask Jesus for the peace he offers us and the world around us. Let us ask for the grace to be like him, bringing peace wherever we go. Amen.